Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4. We're actually on episode 19 now. We've almost hit 20 episodes of the Dreamhouse series, which I think is pretty awesome. And thank you guys so much for your support throughout this whole series. You guys really enjoy it, and I really enjoy making it for you. So it's a beautiful sort of like uh, symbiotic relationship we've got going on here. So. I just wanted to quickly show you this main screen because a few of you guys ask what packs I have and here are the ones I have. It's basically city living, we've got get to work, we've got dine out, bowling stuff, vintage glamour, cool kitchen stuff and then I've got like the holiday celebration pack which we're not going to need for a little while but I just thought I would show that to you guys. So in the last episode Claire and Ali proved that they're not that great apparently. I don't know what it is this time around but they're not being so great for poor little Jessicans. So this episode we're going to be doing some better parenting for them, however we did manage to make two really cool kids rooms, all there and ready for all the little kids, I think they look really really good. This episode Ali wants to go on bros night out, he wants to hit the gym, he's basically going to have a lot of fun. And Claire's going to have to earn some money because we got to three dollars in the last episode which is absolutely abysmal. Just because we're in the dream house doesn't mean we can just have no money because the bills are expensive here, 11,000 pounds our bill was last time. So we definitely need to make some money for the house, otherwise we're gonna get kicked out. We're gonna get kicked out, that's how life works, guys. So if you're excited for this episode, please give it a little cheeky thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. If you guys are in the notification squad, let me know in the comments below. I love seeing you guys in there and I always try and reply to you, so make sure you drop a little comment below. And guys, let's kick off with the next episode of Sims 4 Dream House. Whenever I join the house, I get charged. I get charged just for seeing our house, guys. I don't know why that is, but it stresses me out. Oh, your little toddler has drifted to sleep. So little little baby's in her bed. I actually think, is she just going to sleep? Oh my gosh, it's 5am. Why was she even awake? I feel like already we failed the being a good parent thing because our poor little baby was awake, probably having nightmares or something. And we just left her. Claire's up patrolling. She just has to go read the Glittenspiel. I don't know why. I don't know why. I also realise, I don't think we've shown Ali. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. Cheeky little hot dogs. Thanks, Jamie. We've never shown Ali our little baby Jess. So at some point today, we're gonna have to do that, guys. We're gonna have to show him little baby Jess. So close up very, very early. She's taking this whole earning money thing quite seriously. And look at this. <gasps> Actually, you know what? We didn't pay the gardener and stuff last time. Do we have some bills to pay? Where are them bills at? I, w I was sure we would have to pay some bills. Are they? Oh, apparently they've been played. Apparently they've been paid, which is pretty great. Claire, we need to make some money. Get, get painting, get your paint on, okay? Oh, little Jamesikins is up as well. So we gave James some new hair last episode. Let's go through the doors. I think he looks really cute. He's got like a cool, a cute little fringe going along. Look at him giggling about his steak. Yes, I want to sell it. Just get that thing sold. We're still not at 11,000 pounds yet. Claire, forget the book. Get painting. Do some pop art, okay? Ali is still doing a little sleep. First thing in the morning, he is going to work out. There we go. Ali, you want you to do, do some punching as well. Look at that body. Where's he gone? There he is. Look, he's, his gym is, his gymming is definitely starting to pay off already, guys. Look at that. He works out. And he's walking around his little Calvins. Little cheeky Calvins. Okay. Ali is starting the day of pumping some iron. Getting some iron pumped. And Claire is trying to earn the money. She's trying to earn a little bit of cash because... I mean, it's, it's still healthy, but you've got to think. Living large, like they are doing right now. I think that was the name of like the first ever, ever Sims DLC pack, living at large. Um, for, for Sims 1, means that bills are a lot higher. So although we've got more money, really we don't. That's just the way it lives. That's what the way it is, guys. Once you've got a butler, you've got loads of bills to pay, you paint creepy guys like this, okay. What's little Lallykin's doing? Oh, he's getting his shower. Oh, I thought we would get to watch some of the workout, guys, but he's already done. He's already done it all. He's sore. He's sore after his exercise. Ali hit the gym this morning, actually. Real life Ali and Sim Ali are in sync. There's a beautiful harmony going on between them both. I went for a run this morning, actually. So you know what, Claire? Go for a run, okay? And you can come back, sell 540 pounds. Claire, what is that trash? Oh no, the baby's up! The baby is up and no one's on. She's sad. No one is looking after her. Oh my gosh, I don't know what it is this time, but it's just harder. It's just so much harder with her. She is starving. Jamie, please attend to the minor, okay? Okay, Ali, please put her in the high chair. Just let her eat. Put her in the high chair! What are you doing? No, don't check on her. Just put her here. 
I don't know if it's because the house is so big, but she's gonna starve to death and die. Oh, what the hell? A child can teleport. A child should need to join the X-Men. She's like Magneto or something. So little Claire and Jamesy Bob, why don't they play some chess together? If you remember in the last episode, James completed the rambunctious scamp. I think that was what it was called. So now he's on the uh, nerd one, which one is it? Wizkid. It's good, it's good to be a nerd, guys. He's learning how to do some chess. He wants to play three games of chess. And he wants to read with an adult. I don't even know you could still read with an adult when you were a child instead of a toddler, but apparently you can. Oh, and the baby's on a road again. Where is she? Okay, at least you've been buffed. What's wrong with her now? Fun. We bought you a sick dollhouse. Why don't you go play with that? Play dolls. There you go. Look at this. I mean, it's a pretty basic dollhouse. I'm not going to lie. We'll get, you a, we'll get you the really expensive one at some point. Don't worry. I think it would almost be better if there was like two toddlers so that they could play together. But we only have one right now, guys. That's why we need to have twins at some point. We need to get on the twin hype. Actually, why can't James go play with her? <gasps> yes! James can play with her. James, you can do the parent in that we can't. Oh no, Claire's gone to go play with her. Oh no, she's fallen asleep. James, come play with your sister. Claire, go to bed or something, because you're just a wreck. You're a wreck. Guys, look at this. Jamie doing it in the parenting, because apparently we can't. Well, I'm actually well vexed, to be honest, by that. Look at her just coming to watch, like, ah, oh, yes, that's what I should be doing, but I'm not. What are you doing, Claire? You're meant to be a good parent. You're meant to be the fun parent. That's what the quiz said. Oh, look, she's off. She's like, screw this. I'm going to go make spaghetti. Oh, my gosh. Poor little Jessicans has spent the whole, whole day being sad. I feel so sorry for her with a little cute pink hair. Life should be better for her than this. I'm so annoyed at my, like, rubbishy sims. Like, where is she even going now? Where is Jess, are you leaving? <laughs> oh, she's gone and gone. <gasps> she's gone and stole a salad off the table because no one will feed her. And she's just basically looking after herself. She's Matilda. I don't know if you guys have ever seen the film Matilda, but that, that is Jess because no one's looking after her. She has to do it all herself. The poor little baby! Oh, look at her. Okay, daddy's home to come and look after her. Look, she's just in there like, oh, this is great. Everything's going fine. No, it's not, Claire. And your creepy eyes. You need to take better care of your child, okay? Poor Ali went to work, so he couldn't even have his little bro fest that he was wanting. <sighs> oh, gosh. It's 5 a.m. Jess is up. She's gonna go screaming Claire's ears. <laughs> you know what, Claire? You kind of deserve it. You deserve it. I don't care. You need to be looking after your child more than that. Go give her some food. Forget moaning. <gasps> Feed her before she gets taken away. Our child is literally gonna get taken away. What are you doing, Claire? Where's she gone? She's driving me freaking mad. Just look after your child. Give food to Jessica. She's ignoring me. I feel so sad for our poor little child. Look at her just walking past her. Oh my god, you're so slow. I hit you. Put her in it. Forget checking her. Put her in. Put Jessica there. What is she doing? She's just ignoring me. Oh, she just did that whole teleport thing. Thank god our child has that ability. Okay, and now sit here and talk to your child. You've already put her down. What are you doing? Just sit. There we go. <laughs> now you can just do some little chitty chats with them. Tell her a story. You're going to be doing some parenting today, Claire, okay? Finally actually interacting with her child. Look how cute she is, guys. She's like, I have no idea who you are. <laughs> I have literally no idea who you are. She's like, help! A stranger has come into our house and is trying to talk to me. Ali's up. He needs some food and then he's going to hit the gym. Oh, and look at that. Ali has to step in again. He's trying to teach her how to talk. Look at her. She's trying. She's such a good little girl. And at least Claire's trying to interact with one of her children. With little James. The flea market is in town. I don't care. I don't care. Oh, let's pump him some wine, guys. He's getting there. What fitness level is he actually at now? Where's his little skills? Fitness level three. Oh, what's, oh, is James coming to chat with him while he's working out? Oh, no, now he's off to go watch TV. Practice punching. Push the limits. Go on. you got to actually punch it, Ali. There you go. There you go. Doing some working out. Come on, Ali. You can punch it. You can do it. 
There we go. Oh my gosh, nearly knocked the child over. Nearly knocked the child over. Why is the kid sad, sad and hungry again? Why is no one looking after this poor, poor little baby? What's Claire doing? Playing on a phone or, or a tablet or something. Oh my gosh, Jess is literally there, eating a burger on the sofa. Everyone's up, little poor baby Jess is like no fun, no hygiene, because she spends a whole day trying to get food. It never happens. Today's the day that Ali's gonna go on his night out. I don't think he's got work this evening. No, he doesn't. So, start the day off with some lifting. Maybe he can call his friends. Who does he want to go out with? So, so, where's he gone? Where's Jay the third? Jay Worthington the third or whatever he's called? I looked online. Their whole household is actually based on New Girl. So I wasn't just like, it wasn't just a shot in the dark. That is legit what he was based on. So I think it's pretty cool that we picked up on that, guys, Ooh. and we knew. <gasps> oh, the bills have come and we don't have enough money. It's nearly £12,000. Okay, Claire's got work. Ali, you're gonna have to be the good parent today. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you just are. Oh, look, our poor so child has woken up, covered in her own filth, yet again. But it's fine, because dad is here, the only parent who seems to do anything. And look, he's given her a little bubble bath. Today can be a nice little day for them to bond. There we go. Washing all her cute little pink hair. And then you need to feed her, okay? Because this is what nobody seems to get. You have to feed her. Just like you would do a dog. You've got to feed the child. So go give her some... Go give her some little yogurt for the morning. Some little morning yogurts. There we go. So look at this. Little father and daughter bonding. Having some little breakfast together. Oh my god, how is it 4pm already? <gasps> James is experimenting with his makeup again. I don't even know. James, what are you doing, babe? Like, oops. <laughs> James, why do you keep doing this? Why do you keep doing this? He seems to like it though. Oh, look. He still is being boosted from a good toddler hood, which is pretty good. You know who ain't gonna be getting that? This poor little baby who still can't talk or walk or anything. Claire, time for you to look after your child, okay? Teach her to talk, okay? Ali, you need to get ready for your night out. So you know what? First thing you need to do is have a little bit of a nap. Make sure you're all ready for it. Oh my gosh, Claire's actually doing something good. Is she gonna read to her? Go on. <gasps> Guys, finally! Finally, Claire's been a good parent. She's reading her a little book called Like You for the Time Being. I mean, the child's like, who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Because I never see you. Toddler just looks sad. Why is she so sad? Because she needs amusement. Babe, we're trying to work on that. Turn that smile and upside down. Turn that frown upside down. There we go. Now she's looking a little bit happier. Actually getting some interaction from mum. Looking pretty happy about life for once. Oh no, she's about to wee herself. She's about to wee herself. Oh no, Claire's helping her learn to talk. But through a leaf curtain. Through a leaf curtain. It's like, I'm going to teach you to talk, but you're not going to know who's teaching you. Gonna be a little bit of camo going on there. Okay, Ali Pala, that is enough sleeping. <laughs> you need to invite people out for a night on the town. Let's have a look. Invite Sims. Okay, let's just invite some of the lads. That's that's lads. That's that's lads. Who else? You can come too. You're too young, Philip. James, you cannot come looking like that. Let's night out. Oh wait, Claire. Claire and Ali and friends. Claire, Claire ain't coming. Claire is not coming. Okay. They're gonna go to Club Slate. Traveling with Claire and- No, Claire's not coming! Why do they think Claire's coming? Okay, she's not there. She's not there, it's fine. Wow. Everybody really needs to wee. This guy went for quite a loud suit there. That's an interesting little mustache. We've got Schmidt, who definitely looks like Schmidt. This guy with the glasses on. This guy- Oh my god, none of Ali's friends can dress. This dress is fine. This one's probably okay as well. And then Ali, like, obviously looks the best. Obviously. Okay. So, they're gonna go for a night out in Club Slate. Let's he just is. check out Club Slate. Oh wow, look, oh my gosh. Guys, I've brought them to what is meant to be a great club. The only person in the whole club is a ghost. An old woman ghost is the only person here. What is that? What kind of a club is it when there's only a dead person there? That's how, the club is so dead that the dead are coming to hang out here. Everybody, let's get this party started. Let's go for... <gasps> See a fire. There we go. It's a 712 pound round. It is an expensive round. The club is literally just Ali and his friends and that's it. <gasps> and her. So she was in the club last time Claire and Ali went to the club. 
And you know she's trouble because look at them proportions. Look at them proportions and look at that dress. Also, she's Bella Goff, and I think that she has like the mischievous sort of unfaithful trait. So we need to watch out for this one. Look at her. Doing her little moves. Watch out for her, guys. Watch out for her. So look at this. Ali's having a little chill night out. He's chatting with Schmidt. The bar lady's making- Oh my gosh, look at the drink! It's on fire! The drink is actually on fire. Wow. That is pretty awesome. Everyone's gonna think Ali is such a cool guy for buying him all these like lit little drinks. Literally lit, because they're on fire, guys. You get it? You get it? Look, the club's popping off now. I wish the ghost would go home. Go away, ghost! It's so weird that you're here. There we go. Everybody's having a little dance. I really wish the ghost would go, but never mind. Ali's gonna go chat with the ghost. I mean, it's a once in a lifetime experience. He probably would. Oh my gosh! More ghosts! More ghosts! Three! <laughs> Why is there three ghosts here? <laughs> What is with this club? It has three ghosts. Is it on a graveyard? Has it been built on an ancient Indian burial site? What is going on? Why is there three ghosts and why are they getting down so much? Ali's chatting with this elder ghost. Probably learning the meaning of life and stuff. Because why not? Why the hell not? What's annoying about the ghost sitch? Is it isn't even like cool trendy ghosts? Like, like, ghosts that are kind of popping. It's like old lame ghosts. Just like, why? Why are they here? More fire drinks, guys. More fire drinks for the lads. <gasps> Some of the guys are leaving. Oh no, Schmitty has left. Schmitty, Schmitty, where are you? Oh my gosh, Ali, no. <laughs> Ali, no, don't go for a nap. Don't go for a nap on your night out. Oh, what are you even thinking? Oh my gosh, now he's doing push-ups. Okay, Ali, I think it's time to go home. Ah. I definitely think it's time to go home. If you're literally just doing push-ups and going for a nap. Home time, babe. Time to go home. Off you go. Oh, now he's eating chips. I mean, I think it was a good night out. They had drinks on fire. They danced. They chatted. <gasps> Oops. I think they made friends. I think, I think he had a good night out, guys. It was time to let him out. Go into the world. Have some fun. Dance with some ghosts chat with some ghosts do some push-ups oh my god he stayed out until nearly 6 a.m fair play ali I, I i don't think i could do that so tell you what let's send you to sleep now let's make sure claire's not killed the children oh look it's 5 a.m and they're up <gasps> they're both up and about oh they're being cute with each other where's claire she's just stood in the hallway being like i'm trying my best to be a parent but i'm never good at it Oh, look at these two cute little cutie pies. Playing with the dollhouse together. They have to interact with each other because nobody else will. Oh, and she's just gone to the toilet in her nappy. For God's sake. Can you not do potty by yourself yet? Oh my God. We need to be better at looking after this child, I swear to God. <gasps> look at this. Smith is asking Ali to come and hang out with, for him with breakfast. Yeah, look at that. That means he's made friends, guys. I mean, he was asleep and they stayed out until 6 a.m. So going for breakfast the next day is actually pretty brave. That's pretty brave. <gasps> Look at them getting all dressed up for their posh night out. Also, we have 24 hours to pay the bills before they shut off all the electrics. Okay, let's just get some breakfast, Schmitty. That's it. Let's just get breakfast. There we go. Ali's got like a little bestie now. How sweet is that? Aww. Let's do some little chit chats together. Look how posh his outfit is. You can compliment it on that. Schmitty likes his suits. <gasps> Look who's trying to get in touch. So my neighbor just texted me that the geek con as high gaming score has been broken. You want to come hit that motion gaming mat and see if I can retake the lead? No, because you are crazy. You are literally crazy. You get all snitch like trickers into getting there. We'll be like, where's the gaming convention? And it will just be in a parking lot, and then he's gonna stab us. That's what's gonna happen, guys. There we go. Look at this. A little breakfast. A little bamboo roll breakfast for them both. I mean, I feel like this is not how pro gamers live their lives, but <laughs> as long as he's having fun with it, then I'm fine. I'm fine. He looks like he's got a new little friend for life there. There we go. Had a lovely breakfast together, but I think you're going to have to say bye now because you need to go home. <laughs> You've been out too much recently, Ali. You're not allowed out that much, okay? Look how posh he looks in his little outfit. He knows he is as well because look how he's walking. 
He's like, you know it. He's, he's getting buff. Like, look at his legs. <laughs> look at his leg. Got back home, little Jessicans is up to see. You want to see your child for the first time, Ali? I've seen pictures of her. People say she looks like Boo from Monsters, Inc. Yeah, but we changed her hair a little bit. Aww. So this is her cutesy little room. And then this is how she looks. Let me get right close to her. Where are you, Jessica? Yeah. She's, <laughs> she's hiding now behind a dollhouse. But she's like got a little pink hair with a little cute ribbon oh, in wait, it. The camera's vexing <laughs> me out so much. <laughs> wait, let me, try, let me try from this side. Wait, <laughs> just break off, break off for a minute, babes. Come over here. Come on. There we go. So Real this, dad needs to see you right now. <laughs> this is how she looks. She's got like little pink hair. Okay. Uh, we've look, look at the back. A little bow in okay, it. I like that. She's got like a cute little sailor's dress on. And look, she's really sweet. This room's a little bit dark. Let's just, let's send her downstairs so you can see her in all of her glory. Okay. That as well, look, I made James's room a little bit more like a kid's room. Oh, what? He's grown up quick. What the heck? It looks cool, doesn't Where's it? All the room? Where's all the Pokemon stuff gone? Um, it was in his previous room. It's all in our recording room. Oh. His is a little bit more grown up now, a bit like sportsy and whatnot. And look what I got back. It's back again. What's that? That's his cool spaceship gem. Oh, nice. Pretty cool, isn't it? Pretty cool. Okay, a little Jess. Oh, hey, she all the family's together. She's, she's a little around. bit stinky, but there we go. She is cute. She's walking like a goblin. She's she, cute. Yeah, she she's cute. not great at what. Do you like her hair? Yeah, pause it so I can have a look at her. Nice. Oh, she's adorable. <laughs> Do you like her hair? Yeah. It's pink. I give you some different hair Why as well. Why are you so dirty? Because uh, you've been working out. Why does that mean I'm dirty? It, like, a bad hygiene basically gives you, like, this sort of thing what going on. What the hell? <laughs> I, should, I shouldn't get that for being active. That's not fair. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh! Look in the background. What's he doing? It's the killer butler, he's back again! How can he just come into our house for no reason? I don't know, but look at this. He's cut me up and that's a part of me in a package. What the where's hell? Where's Claire? Oh no, she's safe, she's face. It, where's James? <gasps> James has got new hair, by the way. I, I like that a lot more. Does he look cute? Yeah, he, he looks a lot more grown up. Look at him being like, why is the butler I mean, over there? <laughs> <laughs> why is the butler here again? I can't believe he's come back! Why are, you, why are you not taking the keys off him and saying, fam, if you come back in here and we'll report you to like, the police? This will be the second time we fired him. I think every time we leave the lot, it, it goes back to the original butler. Every time you leave the lot? Yeah. Really? So you're going to have to fire him again. I cannot actually believe he's back. Fire! Get your ass out of here, butler. Oh, he looks so upset, the poor guy. Yeah, but he's Why evil. Because he's rubbish. Oh, All he does is drink, is and then he stares business. over the child's it's cot like that. Okay, that's weird, yeah. So weird. Like Why my is outfit? it like you just come back from Harry Potter? <laughs> You're in Slytherin. <laughs> yeah, Slytherin's the coolest house. Do you not like my outfit, then? Um, no, I like it. I like it. Okay, and then the final thing. You've been hitting the gym. Yes. So you're just going to get... Uh, oh, where are you going? Oh, no, you're off to work. I was gonna say I'm gonna show you I how look buff you're getting. Look at my V-neck T-shirt. I know. When you get back from work, I'll show you how big you've got. Okay. Oh look, I'm actually spending time with my children. She never does that. Really? She's a really bad mum. I don't know why. What? What do you do? Oh my god, she sat drinking. What do you do rather than spending time with your? your... She just like stares at them and doesn't do what I tell her to do. <sighs> she's not a good mum. She's not a good mum. It's really annoying. But she seems like she's trying now. Praise she's her. Trying. <laughs> With her, with her, she's like, oh, I've got a drink. I've got a drink so I can deal with the children right now. Are you attempting to make her potty train? Yeah, she's trying. Oh, oh no, Nita. That's you, I think. Is that me? Yeah, you went out last night. Smashing it. With Schmidt and co. Yeah. And then you went for breakfast with them in the morning as well. Or Wait, like so a proper posh sleep. restaurant. No. Oh, me and <laughs> Schmidt, proper bros. Okay. Why is it loading something? Because you're going to change your workout gear. Oh, we're changing. Yeah. Cause I want, I want to see how buff you've gotten. I look really weird. My legs, my thighs are. Thick. Your thighs are thick. Do you want a new, new outfit? Do you want maybe wear some shorts? Oh my god. I think my legs are too big, babe. I think your legs are too big. <laughs> wow. They don't look right, do they? They don't, they don't look muscular. They just look fat. I don't get it. What have you done to me? I was honestly trying so hard to work you out as well. I don't know what to suggest. How do we? You've it's not got like the slim build. You've just got like the. Yeah, there's no six pack definition. Yeah. It's just like lines and big. I don't know. <laughs> You're like the Hulk. How do we make you slim and tone? I think that you've made me too big. I don't know. I can edit you in cast. That's the thing and slim you down a bit. You kind of look scary. You're too big. You're too big. You made me like that. I don't know what happened. Okay, I've got a way to fix this, guys. We have to become the hacker, though. You ready? Testing cheats. 
I think it's true, or is it enabled? Cheats are enabled, okay. Cast full edit mode. I, I've got your thing, but you're... Crimble. Okay. So you're fully muscular, but your weight was set to oh, like this. Oh, put that down, babe. There we go, that's better. That looks way better, yeah, doesn't that's it? that's so much better. I mean, that's what you need to do, really. No. Oh, oh my, god. my god! No. I just turned into like, a gremlin. No, keep me huge, keep me huge. Okay, so we see how much better you look without the top one now? Yeah, I don't know if it would change though, would it? No, I didn't think it would change. You don't actually get like a full six pack in this, do you? Because I, I might have a skin pack on you, yeah. So you might never be able to get... Oh wow, that's really defined. But your face looks so much better like that. Oh, you can have to keep it like that. I think it looks good like that. Hey, I don't have my dimples on my back. Yeah, you've got cute little back dimples, haven't you? So you can't get the full six pack, but you definitely look so much better right now. Yeah. All right, my job here is done, it's been fun. Okay. Thanks for making me not look quite as fat. <laughs> You did look pretty vard. Oh, that was kind of creepy. Okay, let's let's check out Ali's new improved look, guys. See how he's gonna look now. There we go. Check him out. Doing his boxing. Oh, that, no, Ali, what are those pictures? That's it. Much, much better. Okay, he's trying to do heavy lifting, which is obviously not easy, guys. Yeah, Ali, look at him go. No, come on, do it equally. Equally on both sides. Yes! He's looking buff, guys. He's definitely looking really buff. I look so undefined. <laughs> look at the weather, baby. <laughs> I need to find you a better skin, don't yeah. I? I will do that. If you guys have any good custom content skin, I don't like it when it messes with their faces too much. Keep their face normal, but I want to see some, like, six-pack action, right. you know? <gasps> the Land Grab Power Company has shut off the power to your house. Pay your bills to get it four. switched back on. Oh, no! Claire, pay the freaking bills. You had one job. Pay your bills. Oh, power has been shut off. Oh wait, can we do it on the phone? How do we pay it if we if we can't go on the computer? There we go. Pay your bills, Claire. For God's sake. Finally, the power is back on. Okay. So that that was not good. My power got shut off in our lot. However, Ali got pretty buff, which I think is is pretty good. We finally managed to figure out that we'd set him to be weighty for some reason. Claire still wasn't a great parent. Look at that. Look, mum's not gonna feed me, so I'm gonna have to get the food myself. Oh my gosh, poor little Jim Bob is still being bullied at school, but he's dealing with it, he's he's dealing with it, he's, he's, he's fine, he's all good. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of The Sims with, it's pretty interesting, the butler came back, our power got shut off, Ali got buff, he went on a night out, he went for a classy breakfast with his bros, and Jess got neglected yet again. If you enjoyed this episode, please give it a little cheeky thumbs up. Give us some ideas for what to do in the comments below. And I think I'm definitely gonna now start saving for the cool little pool house, guys. I think, you know what, we forget about the butler for now. Forget about the butler, um, because we never rehired it after we've sacked that creepy guy for coming back. And we will use the money we save from not paying for a butler to build a pool, guys. Oh my God, Jess just literally fell through the chair. So I think, oh my god, she just did it again. Jess! Jess, what are you doing? Get out the chair! <laughs> what is she actually doing? So guys, hope you enjoyed this episode. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!